Twas the age of Queen Victoria's, a period notorious. So many brand new goods we did create. Our list is long and glorious, though I don't intend to bore us. Was a time of great invention. Was it really? What did we invent then? Well, I'm just about to mention. Drum roll, please. Let's raise the tension. <coughs> we invented this music hall. Is that all? Well, a chap called Henry Bessemer invented molten steel, which led to other chaps creating the automobile, which led to petrol tires and bikes. So all that was required was road. So concrete came and tarmac thought up too. You're hired. Tarmac steel, the automobile, seal of rubber wheel, such inventive zeal. Still, there's plenty to reveal. Victorian brains worked overtime to come up with ideas. We invented light bulbs. Nice one. Cheers. Typewriters and radios. Now news was fast conveyed. Hello. A telephone was no good till a second phone was made. Hello. Just did not snooze. Always had another ruse. The latest flushing lose. Films that did amuse. Flashbulb cameras to use. What a picture! What a picture! Vacuum cleaners, toilet paper, post boxes, and stamps. Toilets, aspirin, anaesthetics, locks, electric lamps. Sewing machines, X-rays, comics, ice cream in a pot. Easter eggs and rockets. We invented the whole lot. There's more trains and lines and bridges and the underground as well. Paddles, steamers, prams, and disinfectant for their smell. Sterile doctors' instruments. One last unmentioned brand. Victorians invented the world's first conveyor band. Paddly toy. Invented 1902, the year after Victoria died. Oh, barometers were new. Iron ships are cool. What genius! Thank you. Seems we're almost through. Just one little oversight. We invented dynamite. 